Got a bit of a showing on the sounder here. It's absolutely filthy, but so the boys have got the rods in the water. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Oh, straight on. Oh, <laughs> oh big flag. That's a monster. Good little bye catch there, Joe. Bye. All right, so we were just cruising and I spotted something and I thought it might have been bait, but it's an actual whale shark. Out in the middle of nowhere, I've never seen a whale shark out in here. It's super rare, so we're gonna see if it's gonna hang around, pop in and go for a swim with it. So I dropped the boys off, they're going for a deep drop. I just seen both of them go down. Jared went first, so it means there's a fish on. Just steaming over to them now. Uh, let's see what they got. Fingers crossed for a big jobby. I think that's what Jared was targeting. What do we got? Is it a blue bone? Oh, that's a monster blue bone. Oh, what? Dude, <laughs> that's a monster. It's a bone like that for a while. Eh? Well done, man. A broken trigger finger would work. I just had to pull my other finger across <laughs> to pull the trigger. What happened? I couldn't pull the trigger with that hand, so I'm like, what? Oh. So I pulled my hand across <laughs> to pull the trigger. <laughs> <laughs> what? Jared squashed his trigger finger the other day. Did some serious damage. So down below, he had to swap fingers and shoot that blue bone. than you holy shit holy shit man such good fish well done so were you right in the bottom um just a bit off three three or four meters off the bottom and he came right up at me um yeah turned to his left but nice little broadside shot to me while i pulled the trigger but we got there in the end and beautiful fish man through there and Holding shot. Shoot around the corner and hopefully this wind backs off soon. But so far, man, it's been such a fun start. It is only 9.55, so it's only still morning. Whole day ahead of us. This, this is good stuff. We just pulled up to the beach, go for a swim, have a little snack. We just wait for that wind to drop off a bit before we shoot across to the next island. Maybe go for another spearfish. It's still beautiful, but the crew's just going in now. And, um, woo! How good. So I've thrown the Mavic 2 Pro I've thrown the Mavic 2 Pro now a few more times. And I'm pretty impressed with the camera quality and everything else. The only thing is I still stand by is it's so hard to launch and retrieve from a boat or a ski. Apart from that, it being so compact, I think it would be the best drone to travel with. So I found for the connection issue that I was having. You just use your normal iPhone cord to connect your iPhone to the actual controller and that eliminates the uh, disconnection completely and um, yeah, no dramas with that. All in all, good drone. I still like the Phantom 4 Pro better. Just found this ledge. The girls just dropped on it and said they seen a big coro. 
So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna hop in, bomb it, and hopefully get myself a nice big coronation trout and see what else is down there. You are really close. <laughs> <laughs> Shame that you have food. That is a good I didn't fish. Even see it there. Came right up here. Yeah. That is a good, good fish. fish. Beautiful fish. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, I love when a plan comes together, eh? Oh. All right. That's exactly what we wanted. Big coronation trout. I didn't see it till last minute and uh, just got the shot away before it bolted. I haven't got one this size or this nice in a long time, so. Super stoked. What a beautiful fish. Yeah. We're just punching across to the next island. The wind's finally dropped. Cool. And it's a uh, beautiful run across. We're sitting on 29 knots. Absolutely hooking across there. <laughs> Oh, we end up with a couple of really good fish. We tried to grab some crays, but they were either old and battered or had berries or I just cooked it. I actually got bit by an eel. That was pretty interesting and I got away with it. It could have been a lot worse. Anyway, we just pulled into the bay. Going to get the drone up in the air. The crew are going to go for a swim and a look on the shore. And uh, after that, we'll start steaming back towards town. We've got a couple of, uh, we've got a couple of fish to cook up tonight and a few beers to drink. Yeet. Yeet. Jackie's new word is yeet, yeet.
I nearly had the double tray grab. I had that one, but I couldn't get it out, and the other one had eggs, so I ended up with nothing. <laughs> but it's all good. We'll just keep trying. <laughs> Diana is coming. Yeah, boy. Did you see it, did ya? Yeah. Big tuna. Tuna. Is it? Man, that thing is singing. Oh my God, that rod. Oh. Oh, shark. oh, shark on it. Up. Give me up. Oh, it's a max here. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, that's so cool. That's so pretty. Do you want me to get that? Fly straight on it? Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, wow. Yeah, she's off. Yeah. See ya. <laughs> Hell yeah, that was so much fun! <laughs> Woo! Just steaming back in towards mainland now. I'm gonna head back to mine, fill up some of those fish and cook them up. Woo! It's a little bit bumpy, but it's all good. Alright, we've made it back home. It's a pretty long steam home. We're just gonna unpack the boat, give it a wash, fill up those fish. We're gonna cook one of those fishes as well tonight and have a big feed, all the crew. We get stuck into it, but before the sun goes down. Bum, 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 and keep it ayo, ayo. Oh my god, that is the best. All the medicine is going to be a bit That hurts. 5.2? Yeah, lock that in. I said 7.6. Oh, 7.2. 5.2. 7, 7.2, 7.6. Nah, you locked it in. I didn't lock it in, Jared locked it in. Nah, locked in. 6.4. No, it's on my day kilo. I got the coro, Jared got the blue bone, Jackie got the trout, and D-Man got the rankin. They are very, very tasty fish. Very colourful. Very colourful too. Just like you, Jackie. D-Man. Hey, Jay, okay, look at your hat. Oh, it's lovely. I am a tourist. Yeah. Shorty, what's this? Oh. Hello. Well done. Hello. Very nice, D man. Which slab on it? Yes. Bobby, sit. Sit. Nice work, AJ. We need to buy a big cryovac. The big kick ass one, hey? There it is. Alright, Jared's just going to take the wings off the, the uh, big bone and probably the trouts. And the plan is to uh, cook them up roast style tonight in the uh, Weber Q. Veggie's been on the grill for about an hour now. A little bit of butter. Jared's got the fresh wings over here. What do you got on there, Jared? Uh, so we've got the blue bone and the trout wings. On them we've got a bit of butter, a bit of dill, garlic, lime. See what makes the dream work. Oh man. Mr. Weber expert. Here we go. Woo! And you come back in five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby! What do you reckon? You looking ready? Smells yeah, good. Yeah, thanks. some good. Yes. Even though these are good. Does that look good inside? Ah! Hot. <laughs> the Weber. Mr. Weber himself. All day, every day. Yeah, that's good, man. All right, they're coming off. Ooh. How's that looking over there, Joe? Yeah, that was joy. This is the best part. It's like the scallop. Ooh. Ugh. Eat it. It's like chicken leg. Eat it. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> that's amazing. Mm-hmm. Alright, that's it for another episode. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, subscribe. It's been a big day, so we're keen to tuck into this. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. Don't forget to buy merch. You!
It's a wrap. <laughs> Oh, man, it's so hard to catch. 